In this session, I will explain about recycling of e-waste using hydrometallurgy method. First, let us see what is hydrometallurgical extraction. It is a process that is used to extract the valuable metals and other materials from e-waste using chemical reactions in aqueous solutions. Hydrometallurgical method involves three stages for the extraction of metal. First stage is pretreatment stage. This stage involves physical separation of metal from e-waste and smelting of the mixture. Next stage is chemical treatment stage. In this stage, metals are dissolved in the solution using different reagent agents. Now let us see what are the leaching reagents can be used for this purpose. First one is cyanide leaching. The precious metals like gold and copper easily dissolves in alkyl cyanide like potassium cyanide. Further, electroplating can be made for this solution to obtain pure metal. Next leaching agent is acid or alkali. Many metals easily soluble in the acids like nitric acid, sulfuric acid and hydrochloric acid. Even some organic acids like uh, ascorbic acids, uh, citric acid and uh, acidic acids may also be used to leach some of the metals. Ammonium thiosulfate solution is also used as a leaching agent for some of the metals like gold, silver and platinum as it can form stable anionic complexes. If we compare the cyanide and acid leaching, this reagent is safe, non-corrosive and non-toxic. Thiourea is another leaching agent which may form cationic complex with gold and silver. This is the cheaper leaching agent which gives quick rate of leaching. Even halide solutions containing chloride, bromide and iodide ions can also be used as leaching agent as an alternate for cyanide leaching. Halide solutions exhibit high solubility and high rate of leaching. The third stage is metal recovery stage. Here, whatever metal dissolved in the leached solution is recovered by different methods like uh, solvent extraction, ion exchange method, electroplating, etc. However, the choice of metal depends upon the nature of leached solution. Now, let us see some of the method which can be used for metal recovery. First one is solvent extraction. In this method, the leached solution is taken in a separating funnel and treated with an organic solvent which results in two-phase system. Here, the metal will be extracted to organic phase which will be separated and recovered the metal. Another method is electroplating. For this, an electrolytic cell is constructed by taking pure metal same as metal to be extracted is taken as cathode and uh, any inert metal is used as anode. The electrodes are dipped in leached solution. When a current is applied, then the pure metal will be electroplated on the cathode. Another one is ion exchange method. Here, leaching solution is mixed with solvent and poured on ion exchange resins. The functional group present in the resin will selectively bind the metal ions. Even absorption method can also be employed to recover the metals from leached solution by using appropriate adsorbents. So, out of uh, different thermal methods like pyrometallurgy, hydrometallurgy, etc., the hydrometallurgical extraction is more environmentally friendly as it generates less hazardous waste. Moreover, it can be more easily regulated to minimize environmental impact. 